Let's play a game. Name your favorite dinosaur. Favorite non-pornographic magazine to masturbate. Don't even think about it. Just name it. Ready? You want to go do karate in the garage? Yep! Did we just become best friends? Welcome. My name is Anthony. I'm going to be your host for this week. And did we just become best friends? Yep. <laughs> All right. And this guy with me is Alfredo. And uh, so this is our, our first podcast that we're going to start. And we're going to try to do it a couple times a month. We'll see how it goes. Um, we're going to talk about pretty much anything, whatever's trending, video games, sports, and you know, whatever else we kind of like stumble upon, you know, into our conversations. Yep. Um, man, we've been trying to do this for a long time. A we, long we had, time. We had a practice one a month ago, a month and a half. Probably more. I want to say longer. It was, uh, it was like in January, wasn't it? End of, after New Year's, I think. Yeah, it was after New Year's. Because we were, we started talking about it after we did the drunk gameplay. Yeah. Or the yeah. drunk, uh, the drunk uh, gingerbread house. Yeah, I've seen it. It's funny. I won that gingerbread house. <laughs> yeah, way. I'll put the link yeah. in the description. But, um, yeah, it was like in the middle of January. Actually, we, we did this, and after that, uh, we've been busy. He's at school. I have two jobs and beautiful daughter, and he has his life. I have mine. Life always gets in the way of fun. Yes, it does. <laughs> and it's not like a game where you can pause it and do something. No, it, it keeps going. Yeah. So I'm glad that finally, like upgrade. two months. Yeah, bears. It's awesome. We should get a Cubs. We'll see. Cubs hat. Oh, I'm like, oh, I have a Cubs hat. Oh uh, yeah, this one I forgot. I think my uncle had gotten me. That's a real helmet. That's a real deal. Right. Back, well, that was probably from nineties, early nineties. I want to say. You know, that's the real deal helmet. It, it, I just, just got beat up. Yeah, I'm missing some of the padding for it. Um, but yeah, so yeah, we're gonna do a little bit of everything. Uh, since this week is our our first week, we're gonna mostly kind of talk about each other. You know, um, I think me and you are gonna be the main ones. Yeah. on the show, you know, all the time. Um, and we'll see if anybody else wants to join us, you know, a couple of our friends, and we'll have, like, a discussion about whatever's going on. Uh, fantasy football ended for us in December. Yeah. We were all kind of <laughs> crazy about that. Me and Alfredo, both former champions. He, he won it twice. I won it once. Two um, or four years? This is the four years. This is the, four, the, this is the fourth year, and we That's just awesome. got our, our third champ in four years. Yeah. Um, so, you know, we were pretty big in, in that yeah. in fantasy football. So definitely when football season comes around again. We have yeah. to we have to make a podcast, either discuss it here, or a <laughs> second podcast for fantasy football. Just, just that. Yeah. And only the champs are invited. <laughs> the cha- champions <laughs> only podcast? Yes. That would be awesome. Three people. Three people. Yeah. But, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see uh, whoever else wants to come on. You know, different games are coming on. Obviously, we play a lot of video games. Here we we got do. Overwatch hat. We have a couple friends that play a lot of Overwatch in our... Pretty freaking good at it. Very good. I think I think uh, when I when I saw Omar the other day, he said uh, he he hit Grandmasters or something like that, Jeez. which is like man, that's like almost <laughs> as high as you can get. Well, there's I think it's under top five hundred. So it's top five hundred Grandmasters and then Masters. And I think he got the Grandmasters, and I guess people were telling him like that's like super super hard to do because he's solo. You know, people that <laughs> people that get to that level in Overwatch, we play on the console. We play on PS4. We don't play on um, Xbox stuff. or PC. PC is the main one where PC. you see all that, and I guess it's super hard. So yeah, he's a big uh, he's a big gamer. So we'll definitely try to get other people on. You know, talk about all right everything. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't like politics too much. I feel that gets too no. Yeah. I don't like talking about yeah. So the, the you know, Cheeto and the White House guy. Yeah, we we'll we'll about. probably keep. Keep away from that for the most part. Try to keep it fun. We yeah. are going to keep it fun. Keep it um, like that. It, real quick, you see me keep doing this because I notice my tits full. <laughs> and I like the shirt. There's a dick. A dick, a shirt. Right. That's why I have across my arms. I'm not covering my tits. Boobies. Boobies. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> that's, a, that's full fantasy football <laughs> boobies. Fantasy boobies. That's, yeah. Yeah. That's a. Uh... Yeah, we play Overwatch. Uh, we started off playing WoW. Um, yeah. I've known you how long now? Yeah, see, 14 man. years? So, yeah, I first met you at Lightology. When I was 30? Before I was 30? Before was I got married? Yeah. 
Yeah. You just started. Yeah. Yeah, I, it's just, I think I, I want to say it was 2005. I went 2005 when I started working on Light Algae. You were already there for about a year. Yeah, 13 years. Yeah. And then yeah. this this guy was the one who invited me and put me towards World of Warcraft. Yeah. I was original. Searching. Before all the expansions. Before, before the expansions. I, original. The max level was 60. Right. At the time. Right. The max level was 60. This is before they came out 100 million or 1 million players. We were underneath that before. Yeah. Well, the game was pretty new. I think it came out in 2004, I want to say. I Maybe 2005. No All I know is I played a demo, a trial. I was hooked yeah. after four hours. Four or five <clears throat> hours, I was hooked. And I'm like, sign me up. Yeah. Damn it, Blizzard. I yeah. want my life back. It was it was me, you, and another one of our friends, uh, Armando. Armando. He, Armando's the one that Armando's got Armando's on there, too. Not at the time. Not a time. He he came out a little later. later? Well, he okay. I remember he tried playing, but then he had a, a really kind of slow computer. Yeah. And he, I mean, it just wasn't happening. Yeah. But Armando was was the one that started the game, and then he got me hooked into it, and then I got you hooked into it, and then that's how you kind of got in yeah. to know Armando. That's how you guys became friends. Yeah, we we didn't even meet in person until like a <laughs> month later. Yeah, like that's a right. Month and a half later. Yeah. It's, it's nuts. It's like, yeah, I know everything about you. And this is yeah. the first time I see you in real life. Yeah, it was that was that was nuts. I mean, we were we were super addicted to that game. Yeah, we I were. Mean, we had everything scheduled and planned. We made no Friday nights. We, we you know, weekends. Weekends, yeah. Weekends. I like, I still still like depending on what side you're on of it, it could be like like a really bad weekend or a really awesome weekend. Friday until Sunday, mm -hmm. non-stop Warcraft. I pulled a non-stop. What was it? I pulled an eighteen-hour, twenty-hour shift of just Warcraft straight. Yeah, yeah, easily. Yeah, I remember we, we got home, so we got, we we all worked together, mm -hmm. and then at this time Armando came and he started working for us. Yes, right. Did. And then our other friend Omar, yeah. Omar, he he wound up getting a better computer. He joined the game, mm -hmm. and he was working at Lightology with us as well. It's right. a, a like a warehouse uh, for lighting fixtures, and so all of us were working together and playing Warcraft. So what Friday night we go home, just randomly like oh, everyone's on, so we start doing all that crazy stuff, and then we're like, oh yeah, I'm gonna be back, I'm gonna go blah blah, and then every time somebody's like, oh, I'm gonna come back, like they come back and we're all on together, yeah, and it happened all weekend. It did. All weekend, yeah, it was nuts. So, yeah. I mean, Mando came up with the saying, Hey, it's a beautiful day outside, let's play some Warcraft. I it's, yeah, forget it. War it's a beautiful day to play Warcraft, and it was Warcraft. like 80 degrees, yeah. sunny, beautiful <laughs> day. So, right, let's go inside and just play on a computer for 18 hours or so. Yeah, and we did. We played, we had a blast, we challenged people, and we kicked ass. We were, we made a guild. Remember, remember, oh, remember the name? Oh. Of our yes. first guild that yes. we made, Mr. Fat Fingers over here. Yeah, no, it was I... called Bloodthirsty, but everybody, yeah, badass name. Guess what? How'd you spell it? Yeah, I'm not the greatest speller. It's a T H R I S T Y. Yeah, thirsty. So that yeah. we were the joke for a while. it was. That was uh, awesome. I didn't. I didn't mind. It was bloodthirsty. Bloodthirsty. Yeah, and we spent a hundred gold. And at that time, gold was, was it 100 or 10? I don't remember. Gold was hard to come by. Yeah. You couldn't get gold. You was, you were happy to get silver. Yeah, and was... we were just farming, killing hogs and pigs and selling scrap to making potions in the auction house or whatever you can <laughs> to get money to build this guild. And we hit this 100. I believe it was 100. I, I, and we hit probably. this gold of 100. And a um, hundred gold, and man, and this guy, he went in there, and I love it, Kramer, but this fat finger fuck over here messed it up, and it became the best thing ever. Because yeah. ever since then, we were like, oh, let's Still. name something, Bloodthirsty. <laughs> yeah, it's, outside people are like, what's so funny about that? Yeah, it's 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 a inside joke. It's it been is running for thirteen thirteen years now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it is, it is, it is. so it's whenever I times. see, and then whenever I see another guild that's blood th uh, thirsty, oh. uh, and I, I kind of giggle a little bit like a little girl. <laughs> they actually have that? <clears throat> in the server I'm in now, I saw a couple people um, 
blood bloodthirsty. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, recently I started playing it again. Armando dragged me back in and now it's, it's, I mean, it's still the same thing, but there's so much has changed in 13 years of a video game being out and still millions of people play it, you know? So yeah, it's, it's, it's still pretty fun. Yeah. Um, time consuming. Very. I should not play as much as I do because of school, but I do, you know? Yeah. I'm afraid to go back in it. I just saw a little yeah. bit of it. And I think it's more to your computer that makes it look nice. No, oh, yeah. So I by that I'm gonna say thank God I don't have a computer. If I did, I I'd be homeless. <laughs> <laughs> I really would be homeless, and no one would take care of me, and I would just be playing Warcraft. Yeah. Speaking real quick, have you seen the prices for graphic cards now? No. They are crazy expensive. The, the last time I saw a graphics card was basically for hundred, a hundred dollars, and it was just just a, what not even a fan. It was just like this big. Just the just the card. Just the card. So I I'm, in my computer I have the GTX 1080, right? Mm -hmm. The only there's one above it called the 1080i, and those are those are about the two highest graphics cards you can get right now. When I built my computer, about a year about a year ago now, yeah. Um, the, the card I got was, I want to say seven or $800, somewhere around there. Wow. Which is, which is a lot, right? I mean, for a graphics, for a piece of plastic, basically, you know, it's huge too. Um, that card is probably going for double the price right now. The same card? The same card is probably going for easily twelve, thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars $1,400 because of Bitcoin. I've heard of Bitcoin. Yeah. I just never followed it and understood it. It's just like digital currency, you know, like putting, yeah, it's just digital currency. So what they use the cards for though. So in order to get Bitcoin, um, there's like a, there's a fine amount of Bitcoin. Like there's a certain amount. You can't just create like this digital currency. Right. Mm -hmm. So in order to get Bitcoin, the computer has to solve these like equations, you know, and then you get like, 0.01% of, of one coin or point, you know, you get like chunks, little chunks of the coin. I, I could be wrong with that. That's how I understand how it to be. And they have to use computers to do it, right? So they figured out the actual processing power of a graphics card is enough power to do these equations. <laughs> so all these Bitcoin miners went out and bought these graphics cards you know, and connected them together. And that's like a, a crazy, crazy thing. I'll add a picture somewhere down here, like of a Bitcoin mining station. It's literally like, I mean, a normal person that does it, you know, that I've seen is like four or five graphic cards hooked up together. I mean, I've seen people with like a shelf of graphic cards, you know, just all hooked up together with a power supply running these equations 24 seven, you know, and that's why if they're like, Nvidia was like, oh, cool. All these cards are getting sold so fast. Let's jack up the price. Right. So, yeah. And so, so it's supply and demand. Um, um, when when I told somebody, I'm like, oh, this is the card I got. I think it was Armando. He's like, oh man, good thing you bought that card when you did because now it's like double the price, and that's insane. It is crazy. Well, what if you sell that card and get some cash for it, and then just buy a brand new one or a new one? But I would have to downgrade though. Because even if I sell it for like what it's going for now, it would probably be you. So it would be a little cheaper than a brand new one. Mm -hmm. And then I wouldn't be able to afford the one. So I would have to downgrade like a lot. And for me, I love that graphic. Yeah, well, I stick to it. I, I really like, yeah. <laughs> Maybe later because Bitcoin is kind of taking a dive right now. I think it's like at a thousand. At one point, it was like a 20,000 or something like 20,000. Like $20,000 for one Bitcoin. That's crazy, I, I, man. I, I don't know. It's... I cool. haven't really looked into it. It's like stocks and stuff. People were were putting more, taking mortgages on their house, selling their firstborn child. I mean, they were doing anything to get one Bitcoin or something like that. One you Bitcoin. Know? I mean, yeah. I mean, it being that much money, you know. But yeah. So I got a half a dollar. Thanks. How yeah. Did you get that? Fifty-one cents. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. well, man. But, um, let's see. Yeah. A little bit more you. about myself. Um, I'm basically a football guy. Yeah, I'm more of a, I'm not crazy with baseball. I coached it, managed it. 
the fantasy football, actually one one year, but I'm a football kind of guy. I like football, as you can see. But, um, fantasy football comes around and kind of gets serious, and <laughs> I talk crap about shitty trades all the time. And yeah, people who are usually quiet all year, like in our in our group of friends, when fantasy comes out, yeah, they oh, all man, they all talk, they yeah. all talk. September, um, September is the the month. So, is there going to be a link or email or something? For what? Any questions? No, just comment. You know, if you want to know anything, comment. Um, it's just for sure going to be on YouTube, obviously. Um, but for audio only, I'm I'm going to put it up on iTunes and Google Play. So this is also going to be there. Uh, Spotify. Um, it's really hard to get up to to get onto Spotify. I found out um, a couple podcasts that I watch. Uh, ones like Rooster Teeth. Mm-hmm. And it's Rooster Teeth. I don't know if you know who they are. Red versus Blue. Right. You know, they're about to do their 15 year like um, anniversary thing for for this uh, this company. And they just got on Spotify. Hmm. And, and and it's not because they, they were like, oh, it's whatever. Like they couldn't get onto it because they said they were just having so much issues with, with people there. So Spotify is not something easy to get onto. Oh, maybe eventually that's that's the goal. Well, yeah. But for sure, it's going to be on YouTube with the video. And then audio only, Google and iTunes. And I got everything set up right now. Um, oh, we forgot to say. So we, we were going through a couple of names for the show. Yeah, we were. We were going through a couple of names. One of them was Bloodthirsty. <laughs> yeah, one of them was Bloodthirsty. <laughs> right. um, yeah, and I think we, we decided on uh, did we just become best friends? Yep. Which is why it was in the <laughs> intro. Um, so, yeah. So, yeah. I, I, I put together a really bad, bad um, <laughs> graphics art for it because I, I do not know Photoshop. Like, I'm I'm learning. I'm learning. It's, well, we but, know the right guy for that. Yeah. Yeah. So, Where <laughs> so, are you, Mondo? Come on out. <clears throat> well, there, there is one I want to do. So, if, if any, anybody, anybody listening can send it to us, that would be awesome. I want to do our faces on the Step Brothers, uh, you know, the one where they're like, like on top of each yeah, other's shoulders. The the, well, why don't we just reenact that? We have oh, we Christmas, we could we we, we have we have our Christmas sweaters. I have the UFO alien one, and then I have the yeah. the same one, the green one. Yeah. So mine uh, wasn't really a sweater. Mine was like a t-shirt that was way too big. Mine was like a, like two sizes <laughs> too big. If you watch the video of us getting drunk, you know, um, man. Yeah, my shirt was huge. I think it was like a three, four X maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Watch the Rudolph one first because that led into the gingerbread house. Yeah. Because you just jump in the gingerbread house and you're like, oh, you know, these guys just got drunk and decided. No. <laughs> Everything was perfectly planned by this guy. No. It was it was nice. It, it was, was fun. Nice. It was fun. We had a great time. It wasn't perfect. It wasn't perfect. It was it was my it was my first time it setting was something up like that. I won that contest. You, you, you did. Yep. You came. You, he came closest to building a house. Yeah. You didn't really build a it, house. It was there, the foundation, and just, just <laughs> after a while, it just fell. Yeah. You're supposed to let it sit, I think. But yeah. Um. So yeah. So but yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like uh. So if anybody knows any good Photoshop, that'll be pretty funny. Yeah. You know. That so would and be then funny. we we can see we we'll, we'll, we can do something like that. Um. But yeah. Yeah. So did we just become best friends? Which is. And we've been calling um, or abbreviating it D W J B B F. <laughs> yep. No, that's like <laughs> yeah, that's like the B D F. No, well, let's well, not well. do that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I think it was because of Step Brothers. I I I, I watch that movie like at least once a month. Like <laughs> I'm not even exaggerating. Not even exaggerating. I'm such a big Will Ferrell fan. Um, I I just randomly I like bored Talladega Nights. And then, uh, I don't know if you watched The Office. Uh, bits and pieces. Bits and pieces. So, I'm super behind. A lot of my friends, Omar and other people, were saying, you gotta watch The Office, you gotta watch it. Finally, finally, I started watching it. I'm on the last season right now. And there's a part where Will, Will Ferrell is on the show for, give or take, maybe like five or six episodes. And uh, he's funny, but you don't... Like you don't like him. He's he's a he's very much of a, an a hole, you know, <laughs> about it. And but he is very Will Ferrell in it. You know, I I can see like Step Brothers and the Talladega Nights the way he acted in that. 
you know, was kind of like how he was in the office. And I was I was kind of disappointed that he didn't stick around on the show. You know, I, I thought it would have been good, but you know, it is it is what it is. So, but yeah, I, I watched Step Brothers and then I'm like, did we just become best friends? <laughs> I like that. I like that. And do you remember any little. other names? Oh man, there there was a few because um, I well, there's like uh, there was some, but there were a lot of them were taken. There's like Chicago Basement or like. Um, podcast basement or um, I still have I want I I wanted it to do and then I think uh, Erica did it too. There it is. Erica, yeah, Erica told me about a uh, fat guys in a little podcast, <laughs> and I really like that one. I right. think that was the second one I was rooting for. Right. I don't know if you know where that's from. No, it's from uh, um, uh, Black Sheep, I believe. It's it's one of uh, Chris Farley's thing. Okay. He was, Fat guy in a little jacket. You know okay, I, mean? I see. All right. You know, so I was like, and, you know, and obviously we're both like bigger guys. I'm like, that would have been awesome. Yeah. But then, yeah, it was at the same time. It was like, it was kind of like if you if you didn't understand it, it would be just kind of like kind of funny, but you wouldn't fully right. understand it. I like um, dude, that's the first one we got. I remember my first beer podcast. Yeah, I, I think that one was taken. You sound too. insane. Behind you. Behind, Behind you. you. <laughs> there you go. That's another another one of our friends. What was that? Gears of War? Uh, Gears, of Gears of War. Gears of War. On Xbox where you hope and pray you did not get the three rings of death. Oh, yeah. When Xbox 360. I'm a victim. Of first came out. So it was Andy. Was it? Twice. Yes. Twice. He was a victim of it twice. Yeah. Because he got his first. Got insurance, got exchange, then I got it. He was like, hey, go through my insurance. You just don't pay nothing. All right. So I went through that. I got a new one. And then two months later, he got it again. I don't know <laughs> how or why is that possible? It was, I never got it after that. I, I never had it. I don't know. If, I don't know. I don't know if I know anybody else who got it besides this. I knew you had it. Um, I, I Now I remember Andy had it. But yeah, I never. I, I, I was like praying. I'm like, please don't let it happen. Yeah. You know, but yeah, I never had that issue, which luckily, but yeah, behind you. Was Be, yeah, there was, ah, oh, jeez, how did it happen? Armando was, was it Armando or Andy? It was Andy. It was Andy's thing. We were always fighting and, you know, Gears of War, it's the first person, you, you know, you look forward and just so happens, someone comes up behind us and you Chainsaws or two piece, or two piece, two piece. Two piece yeah. They like hit you and then blow you up with the shotgun. That's right. And every time, I think it's because Andy's internet sucked so bad he lagged a half a second to a full second. Well, there's a lot of cheaters though too in mm, Gears One. Yeah, there was a lot of lag buttons. But the whole purpose of that behind you was after we died and we were like resetting, respawning. He then he says, "Oh, guys, behind you." Like, no shit, we're already dead. You know, we're coming back alive right now. We're running to where we're supposed to be at. But his, he wouldn't say the name. Or he wouldn't say, hey, guys. He would just go, hey, behind you. It was like... Okay. There's eight of us. Yeah. Was it? No. I think it, was, I think it was five on five. Yeah. Maybe six on six. Something like that. So, yeah. So, there's, a, you know, him and a group of, like, you know, four or five, six other people. And we all know each other. We all work with each other at one point. Yeah. And yep. yet, he can't say, Fredo, Kramer, you know, Mando, behind you. Nope, he just said, behind you, you turn Behind around. you. Oh, that it was already too late. Yeah, it was too late. Every time he said it, it was too late. Because by the time you turn around, you have a chainsaw on your face or right. you're getting blown up by a shotgun. And I still want to make a shirt. This is behind you. We have to. And I, I also like want to put something in correlation with Armando. He was notorious for once we, the, the, the battle started, we all ran. We all ran into this room where there's power-ups or whatever. So we're running. Mondo would be first. And then he'll stop and say, you go first. So my dumbass, I've learned not many times because he did it to me more than once. I'll go in and just to set off a bomb. Because these guys will love throwing these sticky bombs on the ceiling oh, yeah. on the wall where you pass and it just explodes. So Mondo would run, 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 stop. and like, you go first. Boom. Okay, now it's clear. <laughs> so everybody else goes. You were the... That was the guinea pig. The, 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 I was going to say, what, the mine uh, detector? Yeah. The grenade detector. When I blew up, yeah. I found it. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Go ahead, guys. 
I'll meet you there shortly. Oh, no, not even because you don't spawn, you're dead, and that's it. It depends on the game, I think. It depends on the game. If I remember, I don't remember one too much now. It got it got clouded by all the the bad ones. I think you die, and that's it. But yeah, I, I think that was it. I, I'm not 100 percent sure, man. But either way, it was fun. Yeah, behind you was still even. We would go to work and I'm like behind you, and this it was like saying just like behind you. Yeah, you know, and then, like it was kind of like another inside joke. But uh, so how about you? Anything else you want to talk about yourself? Um, uh, nah, I mean, right now, um, you know, I, I, I try to play video games as much as I can, um, because I do, I do love video games. Um, my, my grandfather, my dad's father, he plays video games, you know? Really? Yeah. Yeah. Um, when he passed away, I think the PlayStation 2 was out, you know, and, and he bought it. He, he had all the newer consoles. You know, but he would play RPGs, you know, a lot of Final Fantasies and stuff like that. I never got into the game. Some, some, yeah, you know, um, the cinematics, especially at the time, were like crazy, you know. Um, so yeah, so I was always into video games. You know, my uncle, his son, you know, played a lot, so I would play a lot. You know, it was always like that thing, like that people look down on. You know, like oh, you play video games, like yeah. now it's more accepted. I feel like now, because now you have Twitch, which I'm also on Twitch. It's more I don't, I don't do it. It's it's more, yeah, you know. I mean, like, I love watching Dr. Disrespect on Twitch. He is, he's he's a personality, you know, and he's funny. You know, I mean, his personal life, all that, you know, BS that, you know, whatever happened. But his, the, the character he is, is, is hilarious. Dr. Disrespect. Dr. Dis Disrespect. Um, so yeah, if you haven't watched, look him up. He's pretty funny. Um, he's on YouTube. He does a clip, like little highlight clips. I'm on actually YouTube. curious, I know, because I never heard of him. No, oh, he he's like one of the biggest guys on Twitch. Um, but yeah, and I mean, that, there's that. Um, so the thing that's holding me back from playing as much as I can is school. So right now I'm going to school to be a nurse, and I don't know if you know anybody who's gone to nursing school. It is the hardest thing I've ever done, like academic wise, you know, I mean, physically wise, but like mentally, this is, it's so difficult. I mean, it is, it is a lot of information being thrown at you and, and you need to know it, you know, super fast, you know, and, you know, and all my classmates, we all make like jokes and stuff like that. Like, oh, you need to learn this, 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 and this, and you test it tomorrow, you know? <laughs> But the hands-on stuff is super fun, you know, the clinicals at the hospitals, at, you know, at the places, that's, for me, fun. You know, I've been an EMT for a long time, and I'm taking it to step up. But, yeah, I mean, that's what's taking up most of my time is is school. You know, but I'll be done one more year, nice. April 2019, and then go back to school to be a doctor. You know, yeah. So, but yeah, you know, definitely uh, in my, in my, in, I get about three weeks off in between each semester and uh, I, I like playing and I like being on Twitch. You know, I, li I like being on Twitch. That That's pretty fun. You know, I, I don't know if you, like, you, I mean, anybody can do it. You can, you can do it. You don't even need a computer. PlayStation and Xbox has it built in their system now. So you can actually stream onto Twitch from your Xbox, from your PlayStation, and you don't need a camera, you know. And then if you wanted one, you can just get, you know, a cheap, you know, USB camera and pop it there. Oh, but yeah, I mean, yeah, you know, a lot of the bigger streamers, you know, some of them started playing on console, you know, and then they moved up to PC and bought a big old expensive PC and doing all the crazy stuff. But yeah, that that's where the fun's at. But time, yeah. time, time and consistency, which I don't have either. Because you have to be consistent, you know, have a schedule for, for Twitch if you want to be successful. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, Dr. Disrespect, I think his, he was, he, he, he had a big thing that happened in his personal life and he was off for about a month and he came back. I think when he came back, man, he was getting donations like crazy. I, I want, I want to say he made about 20 to 20, 25 grand. Wow. Maybe, you know, between all the donations and, and stuff like that in one day. You know, he made a lot of money. He made, I, there was one I saw, he got like a, like a $2,000 donation or something like that. <clears throat> Hundreds of dollars at a time, you know, plus all the little dollars, you know. 
Yeah. So I yeah. feel it, it's so much different now. And then that was one thing my my girlfriend Erica, she like all the time, all the time, like tells tells me it was like, you guys are stupid. You goes you guys should have kept playing Minecraft, you know, and oh, put it on God, and, and put it on uh on YouTube. Well, this is before Twitch. Put it on YouTube. These these big YouTube gamers started when we were playing Minecraft, man. Especially the big Minecraft people. Yeah. Like, I'm like, man, I'm like, that could be us. That could be us, you know. We, we could have been up there, you know. We know. I mean, I don't know if I, because I still do like Minecraft. I, I, I play occasionally um, with my girlfriend. We have our, our server and we build all this, like, cool stuff. Um, but, yeah, no. Armando still has the video, uh, the YouTube link for the the city right. on, on his YouTube channel. I saw it uh, yesterday. Oh. Actually, I was just going. Is through that the one stuff. that we built? Yeah, yeah. It was most of you guys. By the time I joined, you, it was most, mostly yeah. done. Um, I mean, that's small now compared to sure what people do now. I mean, I mean, at the time when Minecraft first came out, you had to ride a pig. There was horses now. Yeah. What the fuck? Is there's <laughs> see the only yeah, the only thing horses. we have is travel from point A to point B is you built a railroad track, yeah, and then you had uh, some green uh, some red stuff some limestone or whatever put the switch, and then connect it, and then there's an end, and you click. I know this because I built an underground tunnel from point A to point B, <laughs> and then point. A and B again, and we're across in the center of the town. And, oh, that's right. And I, I built this thing, and I died so many times. I lost <laughs> so much armor because I, you know, you're building up. You want to do oh lava. Yeah. And you hurry up, put a sand block, which doesn't work. And then I hit the wrong button because you put a sand block above. Yeah, it's it gonna drops. Come, right. Yeah. Then you carry a bucket of water, and yeah, it's it's hell. I do like, but it was fun. And, yeah. Oh yeah. It's and, it's still. Fun. It, I remember just, fun. you build, 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 just to tear down, tear down, and tear down, and build again. It, it was crazy. And I built a a skull. We built a stadium, and then outside the stadium, I wanted to build a skull where people could go in it. But the skull was so massive, and I got the sketch. Um, it, it came out. It, yeah, yeah. It, it came out nice, but I, I got the diagram off the internet. But I just never knew how large of a scale <laughs> it was going to be. And next thing you know, it was like just as tall as the stadium. I'm like, uh, okay, we'll keep it. And I want to build one. That's it. Yeah, it was huge. It was huge. And mind you, this is when, when Minecraft first came out. So the the add-ons and the mods for, for it at the time was very, very limited. You know, you didn't, you didn't have what you have now. Now, <clears throat> I mean, you can download uh, texture packs. Oh, really? So the water looks like water, and it's gorgeous. Um, yeah, there's so much more so you can you can download, you know. And you know, I watch like uh, Joey Grisafo, Grisafo, something like that. Mm -hmm. He's one of the bigger Minecraft guys, you know. Watch him, you know, Strawberry, you know, uh, Megan, Lizzie, like all these people. And I'm like, these people, like they they're fun to watch. They're they're super fun to watch. But I, at the same time, I'm like. We were doing this. We were doing this before they were like even playing video games or well, yeah. well one of them was like in their thirties. You know, a couple of them were in their thirties. But I was like, we were doing this. Like we were playing Minecraft like way back when, you know, and, and we just didn't have the foresight to think like, hey, let's let's record ourselves. Right. Yeah, you we, know. We Armando Mar no, I think about Armando did it. I'll put the link up here somewhere, you know, or in the description of, of the city. So he did record it. Which one, Mag Magneto? Mag Mega De Mega Delago, whatever. Yeah, <laughs> I it was, it was cool. Name. He made a music video of it <clears throat> with Nickelback. <laughs> go back. Let me go back. Um, but yeah, no, yeah. Do you I remember mean, the, he, the he mountain made. that I built? Like the Mount Rushmore. The Mount Rushmore. Kinda. There was characters on there. It was just us four, though. Yeah. You, me, Mando, and I think some other dude. I think not even. No, I think you just took a you just took a face, another character's face. Yeah, yeah. And I, I, it, yeah, it was awesome. I think it's in the video. I hope it's in the video. I I think it is. I think it is. Yeah, I, I put it up. But yeah, I was watching that uh, yesterday. I was like, oh wow, man. You know, I was like, we could we could have been YouTube famous by now if we if we would have just recorded and stuck to it and stuff like that. You know, you know, and I watch like some of the bigger guys like Markiplier and Jacksepticeye a lot. 
Mm-hmm. And I and you know, every so often they'll do remembering when they first started. And they were so awkward when they first started. <laughs> just I mean, not awkward. I mean just, Wait just to get a lot of us. You don't know yeah, right? <laughs> you just don't know what to say. So they're very quiet. You know, and, and then they're doing a one-on-one type of thing. So they're playing a video game by themselves, talking to a camera. You know, and you think like, oh, now everyone's vlogging, everyone's twitching yeah. and, and doing yeah. that. But back then, 10 years ago, you know, 13 years ago, that was a weird thing to do, you know? It was. Like, you'll get, you get the person you're living with, your parents or your girlfriend or whoever, like, why are you, why are you talking to yourself? Yeah. Exactly. You know, it was like, oh, no, I'm making a video, you know? But now... But yeah, man, man. We all, at the time we all had pretty decent computers, so we had the the capability of doing it, but yeah, without a problem. <sighs> yeah, but it just didn't just happen. Never, never crossed our minds. No, I remember when Twitch first came out. It was it was when it first came out. I forgot what it was called. It was like Justin TV or something like that. And I'm like, this seems stupid. <laughs> I legit thought it was stupid. I'm like, who wants to watch other people play video games? Everyone watches it now. Yeah. My, yeah. my, uh, especially the kids. Daughters, yeah. My nieces, my nephews, they watch it. Yeah. My daughter's cousin, she's eight. She watches it. Yeah. And all, and all it is is just Minecraft. Mostly, yeah. And Most the, the storylines, you know, these Minecraft towns or whatever, they have a story. It's, oh, let me open this or whatever. Yeah. Uh, my artistic niece, Yellow, she watches somebody just opens a surprise box where it's a, it's an eggshell chocolate. Oh, yeah. And you take the foil off, and then you had a chocolate egg, and then you, in that egg, there's a little surprise, and you open that, and what? Really? Yeah. Do kids like this stuff? That's, that's the big thing. There's a couple of videos on my channel of me opening up uh, the loot crates. Yeah. You know, and yeah, uh, the, fir- the first couple ones, I wasn't sure what to do, you know. Um, you know, so you, you had me open it up, and then like... <laughs> A lot of the, the scrambling to get the next thing. And then I think uh, I think I was kind of drunk. I, was, I think I was kind of drinking when I decided to edit one of the videos. Because then there was like clips from Rick and Morty and audio in the background and, and different things. And I'm like, and it was only like three minutes, you know. But like everyone told me, goes, that one was good. That was fun. That was, I, I, I enjoyed watching it. I was like, oh, okay. You know, and then it kind of like... Like, oh, that's what you like. So, see what alcohol can do to you? Yeah, make you uh, more creative. Yes. yes Only if you're 21. Speaking of, and older. <laughs> now I got an empty, <laughs> empty beer. Empty beer. Next, next time we'll get, we'll get some more beer. Yeah. We'll get a beer or something like that. Remember, drink only when you're 21 and older. <laughs> yep. But yeah, but yeah. So I think it's a good spot to to end it for for this week. Yeah. It is. Um. This one's a little, just kind of a background of us. Nothing, nothing, nothing too crazy. So we didn't get into like any like crazy topics or what's going on in the world or, you know, social media world and all that good stuff. Um, but yeah, you know, just a little background is our like pilot episode. <clears throat> just talking about us, you know, hopefully we get a couple of our friends to join us. Yeah, you know. that'd, that'd be fun. Um, that'd be a lot of fun. Like I said, you know, maybe two times a month you know we'll see what we can do you know like like alfredo said life life gets in the way of having fun and you know this is uh this is fun right but you know we'll, we're gonna try to do what we can and, and see um i'll probably upload this fairly after fairly quick after we we do this i don't want to wait a week and <laughs> information like oh we're talking about spacex and then it's a month later you know like hey this what? this conversation SpaceX? is like sex SpaceX. Oh, X. Yeah. <laughs> SpaceX. This guy. Yeah, SpaceX. <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah, it was a pretty good one. Any, any last words? Uh, no. Yeah. I just hope that, you know, this yeah. thing's off and um, we're kind of behind as everyone's already doing their own podcast kind of thing. Uh, there's, a, there's a bazillion to listen to. Right. So let's just hope we're part of the certain percentage where people like it and hopefully we we come big you know i mean let's start small of course you know that's the ultimate goal however let's start small and you know if there's any topics and you want us to discuss discuss, i'm trying to work things out and make things have it on a schedule which will be fantastic and um yeah 
Mm -hmm. Everything. Once, once we get on a schedule, like we're gonna do it this time every week or whatnot, yeah. then I think we'll uh, we'll be able to maybe go on Twitter and get you know any any questions on Twitter if we see or you know see whatever's trending and talk about stuff like that. Yeah. Or if we're playing Overwatch or you know got a PS4, my what's it called Gamertag? Steel Jersey. Oh yeah. Is he Steel Jersey or Steel Jersey ninety five? I don't even know. I haven't played in so <laughs> long, but it's one or the other. And um, yeah, you can hit me up from there, and we just do something. Yeah, I'll throw in our uh, like uh, Instagram links and our. Uh, I have a Twitter. I put all our social media stuff and all our gamer tags. Mine's pretty easy. It's Tank Kramer for everything, <laughs> you know. So <clears throat> I was pretty lucky with that. Which that name also came. From when we first started playing World of Warcraft. Same thing as Steel Jersey. Same thing as Steel Jersey. So yeah. those those gamer tags are over a decade old. <laughs> yeah. Man. Dude, I, now I feel old. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I think that's that's where we're gonna end it for this week. Yeah. Um Yeah. Thanks thanks for everyone for listening to uh you know a bunch of the guys just talking about uh, a whole lot of randomness. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, you know, and you don't want to miss out on uh, our next episode, just hit the subscribe button. You know, until next time, thank you guys. See you guys later. Have a good one. We're not like you. We're grown-ups,